Jamelis, also lives in the palace. Do you know why Caligula is here? I brought Caligula here because you're not ready. But I'm your grandson. It doesn't matter. All anyone would see is a spoiled brat sitting on the throne, incapable of ruling an empire. I'm capable. You think if Caligula comes to power, he will let you live? You no longer have the luxury of childhood. While Jamelus could continue the family reign, Tiberius knows that by handing the throne to a child, he'd be putting the entire Roman Empire in danger. The Senate is expecting me to name a new heir. Your cousin Jamelus is the obvious choice. But he's young. And even when he comes of age, Oh, he was raised as my grandson. Spoiled. Soft. The Senate might prefer the son of Germanicus. You're naming me next in line. I'm considering it. Will you release my mother? You earn my trust. Crossing into the territory. Jamalus, what would you suggest? Can't we just send an army and attack them? Caligula, do you agree? The last thing we want is a full scale war with Germania. We could send a legion to patrol the border, stationing them on the west bank, with strict orders not to cross. Their presence should be enough to deter the tribes from raiding. See to it, a legion is sent to the Rhine. Strict orders not to cross. There was a process on the island of Capri. I mean, it was a dynamic in which Caligula and Chimelis were auditioning for the role of emperor. It's hard not to feel sorry for Gamelus, Tiberius' grandson. He should have been the natural successor to Tiberius, but it's notable also that Gamelus wasn't trained in the same way that Caligula was. 